He's been at the forefront of Hong Kong's pro-democracy movement since 2014. But now Nathan Law has fled the city, choosing to continue the fight from an undisclosed location overseas, where he can't be stopped by the new national security law imposed by China earlier this week. It is difficult for me to plan out anything, given that the circumstance is so unstable. But I will definitely be vocal and active in the international level and deliver Hong Kong people's demands. France 24 met Nathan Law in 2017, not long after he became the youngest lawmaker elected to the city's legislature. Prior to that, he rose to prominence as one of the student leaders of the pro-democracy umbrella revolution in 2014. I consider myself my first role as an individual is an activist. Law also founded pro-democracy group Demosisto with fellow activists Agnes Chow and Joshua Wong. The group dissolved on Tuesday as the national security law came into effect. Under the new legislation, certain political views such as wanting independence became outlawed overnight, prompting Hong Kongers to scrub their social media accounts, download VPNs and switch to more secure messaging apps. The law grants local police wider surveillance powers and rights groups warn its broad wording will choke civil liberties and free speech. On Wednesday, police used water cannon, pepper spray and tear gas in confrontations with demonstrators who defied a ban on protests. 370 people were arrested, including 10 under the new legislation. Well, there you have it. You are up to date.